Look what just arrived. The Pocket of Peers Tarot. Ooh, it's so cool. Uh, this was a Kickstarter. Pocket of Peers Tarot Deck. Class of 2021. I got a little bookmark with a tassel too. Ooh, nice. I got a Let's Get Social. Here's all your social stuff for there. I'm just saying, you know. Here's all your social stuff. You can, uh, oh, you're not supposed to, not supposed to say that probably. You get stickers. I got two things of stickers. There is one sticker. There is another sticker. And uh, I'm guessing this is the deck. By process of elimination, I'm assuming that this is the deck of cards. It didn't quite well wrapped, I have to say. So on the wrapping scale of one to 10, I am gonna give that a nine and a half. I'm just saying, not bad at all for the wrap. Okay, uh, this is a little card holder where you put a little card in there and it'll angle up and whatnot. I can sample it with a bookmark. So it'll hold your card up like that. Anyway, uh, very cool, it's made of wood too. Very nice. Okay, so here, pocket appears, deck finally. I think 90% of the people do want to see this. The deck of cards first and foremost. So we're going to skip directly to that. And uh, we'll take more looks at the extras later. Ooh, nice. A plus for presentation. I have to say, A plus for presentation. It's the standard. Oh, it's just, that's cool. So it just caught me off guard there. You caught me off guard with this coolness of that. And uh, yeah, there is the tarot deck. Here is the back of the box, and uh, you can read that. And there is the front of the box, side of the box. It's signed or it's printed on there. I don't know which. Anyway, cool. All right, here is the deck. Everybody wants to see the back? Now you saw the back. Let's uh, unwrap it. Take the little, uh, take the little deck condom off and uh, check it out. <gasps> Look at them edges. I'm just saying, them edges. Mmm, that is nice. That is very nice indeed. I like that. All right, let's take a look at the cards finally. The Fool. There we go. The Fool is uh, taking an adventure in Terra. We have the Rose and the Dog in a little uh, unusual, in a little unusual way. Card quality is freaking amazing. Card quality is immaculate. Uh, I have to say, card quality is immaculate. And uh, A plus for card quality on that. We have the Magician, Crone's Meadow, uh, Herbalist. So there we go. There's the Magician, and then the High Priestess. I'm, I'm assuming I'm supposed to know who everybody is. And I haven't looked it up yet. I'm assuming all of y'all are screaming at the top of your lungs, telling me who everyone is on every card. Uh, so in case I do not know someone, then, you know, that's, that's my bad. Anyway, there is the High Priestess, the, the, okay, the High Priestess, the Empress, there we are with the Empress, very cool, I like the, uh, the paintings and whatnot, cool, the little book study, I like that, and the Emperor, very cool indeed, so we have the Hierophant, the little text on the phone and whatnot, really can't read that? I need some better glasses than what I'm wearing to read that. I'm sure you can pause it, zoom in, and take a look at what is on the phone text. The lovers. And the car, you know, sort of memories. I like that lovers being memories. I think that really sort of pulls it in and makes it nice. We have the chariot. Very cool. And the strength. I like the cat. The cat looks very comfortable indeed. And we have the Hermit. And the Wheel of Fortune. So cool, I like it. I love the Wheel of Fortune, that's pretty cool. It's got the wheel there, then you have the, um, uh, one of the Sphinxes maybe from the Chariot or whatnot. Do that, we have the Open Tarot Box. Seems to be a common theme of the Open Tarot Box. Justice. And yeah, these are kind of sticking a little bit, not too much though, not really, really bad. And uh, the hanged one, we have death. Oh, I said not too bad. 
And then I get this, uh, here we go. And temperance. Hmm, cool, I like it. Then we have the devil. And the tower. And the star. The moon. The sun. I love the embracing of the horse. That's pretty cool. We have awakening. Sort of a dual-sided action there with the open gate. I like that. So the prospect of going outside there is very cool. And then the world, someone giving a reading to someone else. And of course, using this deck. Oh, I get it. You say using this deck. Well, maybe not. Well, that doesn't look like this deck. But they're the, using this deck. Yes. But those are not this deck cards. So I'm not sure. Maybe that's the next deck they're going to use. Ace of Wands, a little watercolor action going on there with a, a nice fluffy brush indeed. So pretty cool. We have a little fire aspect over here. Then we have the Two of Wands. And the Three of Wands. Uh, the Four of Wands. The Five of Wands. I love the Rubik's Cube. Interesting. A little conflict going with the Rubik's Cube action. I do have a Rubik's Cube trick I do on my stream. In case you want to see it, go check out the stream. Six of Wands. So this is pretty heavily based around the people. So if you know who the people are, if you have a listing of everybody and who they are, that's going to be a big benefit for you there. Seven of Wands. Eight. Unicorns are real indeed. I agree. The nine. And stuck together once more. And the 10. There's a lot of microphones. We have the page. And the night. The queen. The king. And now to the cups with the ace pouring out. Pouring out. A little watercolor action in the background there with the lilies or whatnot. We have the two of cups. Love. And then the Three of Cups. Uh, four of Cups. And the Five. Six. Huh, okay, interesting. Seven. Eight. Nine. Ten. The page. Night. Queen, King, Ace, Two, Three, Four, Five, six, seven, 
eight, nine, ten. Acupuncture action. Page night. Queen, King, and finally into the Pentacles with the Ace, Two, Three, Four, Five. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten, page, night. Queen, King, and Teacher, of course, and Teacher again, and the study. So you probably recognize many people in here. If you recognize all 81, then uh, yeah. You're much more into the, uh, the social aspect than me. <laughs> so, so basically it looks like a deck that is designed for having the tarot community be on a deck of cards. Uh, a lot of cards, people just facing us, staring into the camera. A couple of people doing some actions and whatnot, but quite a bit of just, it's mainly focused on who's who. Uh, it does seem like Angelo, right? Focused on who's who. So I don't recognize a lot of people in here. I may go back and edit this and uh, provide information on uh, each and every one. We may do that. Or if you don't see it, well, then you just have the Pocket of Pierce tarot deck. Overall, I like the art style. I like the realism with combined with the art. I like the extras. I thought it was kind of cool. And uh, overall, I like the deck. I definitely am going to use it on stream. This is a beautiful deck of cards. Thank you for watching. Please hit like and subscribe. We'll see you next time.